Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. So today I'm going to be looking at a one of these dairy-free yogurts. So this is by the brand uh, Nudie. I looked at their products uh, quite a while back. I think it's like my fourth video or something I uploaded. So I, I picked up another one. This one is mango and passion fruit flavored yogurt. So I tried their plain yogurt before, I think. So I don't know. What has this one got in it? Uh, besides the regular coconut milk, that sort of stuff, it's got a bit of mango, got a bit of passion fruit, I think. Yeah, mango puree, passion fruit, puree, some monk fruit juice, which will give it a bit of sweetness. So, yeah, so it's gluten-free, vegan-friendly, etc., etc. Let's get straight into this one. Yeah, of course. I remember this one had that stupid thing on the thing, Cow's Eat Holiday 2, apparently. Because this brand makes dairy yogurt as well as dairy free yogurt. So, I don't know. Looks like this packet might be partially open. Yeah, it was. Yeah, you get what you get. Got a nice thick sort of uh, texture to it, just built some. Let's try it out. Nice and creamy. Ooh. What the heck? Well, I've got to judge the yogurt for this first. Yogurt's nice and creamy. Uh, it's a touch watery, but this has a very zesty sort of flavour to it. I don't know what the hell that is. It's not particularly striking, it's something nice. Actually, this tastes like uh, plain yogurt with a very small amount of passion fruit or mango mixed into it. So that's that basically what it is. Nothing more to say about it than that. It's, it's, I, I don't think this is nice as a flavor. As a yogurt, uh, I don't know. I don't really know, really. You've got Coca Belly, you've got Naka Laws, they're a lot better than this. And this brand makes dairy yogurt too, so this isn't really that great of a brand to be honest. When they're not that great of a brand and, and this yogurt's not that great, it is in the top of vegan yogurts, but it's definitely not close to being the best. So, probably not worth picking up, but if you do decide to pick it up, not that flavour, no good. Way too weird and zesty and overly tangy. It actually tastes like off yogurt. Yeah, well, I don't know. It was slightly open, maybe it is off. <sighs> Whatever. After you view what I've got, and that's what I've got, I say no. I don't like this. If you do like this, you can let me know in the comments. But I'm guessing you haven't bought this, which is why you're watching this video. That's why you typed in whatever this brand is with all my videos and the word review afterward. And after typing that in, I'm the only thing that comes up. So you watch that, and then you make a decision. Don't buy this. I don't know I can tell you for that. So that's all there is for this video. If you want to see more vegan food reviews, then you can hit subscribe. And if you don't want to see more vegan food reviews, why did you come in the first place? I mean, but then again, I can relate. I don't watch my own videos, so I don't know why you would either. But that's all there is to it. So you know, I guess I'll just see you next time.